SkyQ power issues are surprisingly common, affecting 15 to 20% of users within their first two years of ownership. The problem is especially prevalent in older SkyQ Silver and 1TB models. When your SkyQ box randomly shuts down, it's usually trying to protect itself from damage. Understanding the four main causes can help you identify and fix the problem. The most common cause is overheating. SkyQ boxes have internal temperature sensors that trigger automatic shutdowns when the temperature exceeds 65 degrees Celsius. This usually happens when dust blocks the ventilation ports or when the box is placed in an enclosed cabinet without proper airflow. Power supply problems are the second major cause. Faulty power adapters can deliver inconsistent voltage, while aging capacitors in units over three years old may cause voltage fluctuations. Power surges can also damage internal components. Software-related issues form the third category. Corrupted firmware can cause system instability while auto standby settings may conflict with recording schedules. Memory leaks in certain applications can also lead to system crashes. Finally, hardware degradation affects older units. Hard drive failures can trigger protective shutdowns while motherboard component wear affects power regulation. HDMI handshake issues with certain TV models can also cause unexpected shutdowns. Understanding these four main causes, overheating, power supply issues, software problems, and hardware degradation is your first step toward solving SkyQ shutdown problems. Each cause has specific symptoms and solutions that we'll explore in the troubleshooting section. When your SkyQ box keeps turning off, start with a complete power cycle. This simple procedure resolves most power-related issues. First, unplug your SkyQ box completely from the power outlet. Wait at least 30 seconds to ensure all internal capacitors discharge completely. While the box remains unplugged, press and hold the power button for 10 seconds. This drains any residual power and resets the internal circuits. Reconnect the power cable and turn on your SkyQ box. Monitor it for 24 hours to ensure the power cycling has resolved the shutdown issue. Overheating is the leading cause of SkyQ power issues. Your box needs proper ventilation to prevent automatic shutdowns triggered by internal temperature sensors. Maintain at least six inches of clearance around all sides of your SkyQ box. This allows proper airflow to keep internal components cool. Clean the air vents monthly using compressed air to remove dust buildup. Dust accumulation significantly reduces cooling efficiency and can cause overheating. If your SkyQ box is currently in an enclosed cabinet or entertainment center, consider relocating it to an open area with better airflow. Auto standby settings can sometimes conflict with recording schedules and cause unexpected shutdowns. Access your SkyQ settings to adjust these parameters. Navigate to Settings, then Setup, then Standby Options. Temporarily disable Auto Standby to test if this resolves your power issues. If you prefer to keep Auto Standby enabled, increase the timing to four hours or more. This prevents the box from shutting down during normal viewing periods. If basic troubleshooting doesn't resolve the issue, try a factory reset. This clears corrupted firmware that may be causing system instability. During startup, hold the backup button for 20 seconds, then select Reset to Factory Settings. You'll need to reconfigure your preferences afterward. Check your power adapter's output voltage, which should be 12 volts plus or minus half a volt. A faulty adapter delivering inconsistent power can cause random shutdowns. Inspect the power cable for any visible damage, kinks, or wear. If the adapter tests outside the normal voltage range, replacement may be necessary. Prevention is better than troubleshooting. Maintain your room temperature below 25 degrees Celsius to reduce thermal stress on your SkyQ box. Always use a quality surge protector rated for at least 1500 watts. Power surges can damage internal components and cause recurring shutdown problems. Keep your SkyQ box away from heat sources like radiators or other electronic devices that generate heat. Heat buildup is cumulative and can overwhelm the cooling system. Follow a simple maintenance schedule, weekly visual inspections, monthly dust removal, and quarterly settings reviews. This proactive approach prevents most power-related issues. Following these troubleshooting steps, resolves 85% of SkyQ power issues.
If problems persist after trying all these solutions, contact Sky Technical Support for hardware replacement or professional diagnosis.